We're in Da Nang, Vietnam, and welcome to the adventure. So hi, this is where Wade's picked for us to stay. The Adelaide Hotel. It's just one building with no buildings next to it. Just skinny building. Let's go check it out. Adeline Hotel. It's actually like a hotel. I wonder yeah, if there's, 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 there's I'm ordering room service. There's a few um, of them. We ventured up to see what's on the roof of this apartment because apparently there's a pool. Bazinga! How cool is this? So, there we go. This is our pool. We'll sit here and, and see the sunset. So right now we're going to head down to the beach and go see if we can get a swim. That statue is awesome, eh? No, there's a lifeguard flag. Let's go swim there. How's this water? Cold. Oh, no, it's warm. Oh, big car running. Water is very salty. So we had to switch over to the iPhone because the GoPro has got wet and it's giving me an SD card error. So we're going to dry the GoPro out and we'll be filming on the iPhone for a bit of this cool steakhouse we're getting like a hot skillet of stuff. Look at that. Look what I got. You sure that's enough, Matt? I hope that sauce is filling. <laughs> there you go. Sorry, that's how it's done. Hot skillets. Let's cook. For the rain, this is where we ate. Babylon Steakhouse. Oh, they got it upstairs. Wait, should we go upstairs? Right, the GoPro is working again, but without stabilization because the camera is too cold for stabilization. We've uh, fixed the SD card error, which was because we had water inside the GoPro. Yeah, you can smell the sushi and fish. Yeah. Oh, you wanted your fruit, just so you get your fruit. Yeah. Before you leave. Yeah. Way got carried away. Yeah, I got carried away. Well, I got. <laughs> There's five in my family. <laughs> we got <laughs> we got matching vests. <laughs> yeah. Wow, this is cool. Is it a temple? Is it a old ancient town? We're not sure. We'll look it up in a few minutes. Other tourists, yeah, got a book. Ah. We don't have we don't have Google to check. Yep. So we'll let you know afterwards once we figure it out. So what we discovered, cool temple or something, like old school buildings, lots of scooter noise, lots of shops, lots of people trying to sell us stuff, and you need a ticket when you go visit places. Ticket requested. So apparently one of the things, the local tradition is you gotta get sugar cane juice, so I'm gonna check this out, sugar cane juice. Right. Hello.
Thank you. Right, so, I got myself sugar cane juice to see how it tastes. So good. Best, best thing. Way it's missing out, definitely. So, I got a sugar cane juice. It's really cool. Very sweet. When they're making it, the juicing machine looks very old and uh, I know it's a health and safety stance, but the lady was wearing a mask, so it's, it's safe. Cool, so we did a bit of exploring around uh, Hoi An and um, now we're just waiting for the taxi is going to come back. It's just doing a trip. We saw a guy and he said he will take us back out the side. Just waiting wait, wait to get some more cash. Hey, now we're back here. Gonna go and uh, have some lunch. No rest. A few moments later. So we came to this place. We were just going to go down to the water's edge, but uh, the guy's like, no, just pay me to go past because it's the place. Yeah. The taxi guy says there's the bush there. Oh. Uh, yeah, we found this cool spot. The taxi dropped us off in the middle of nowhere pretty much and there was this guy was like, oh, you must pay me to come down to the beach. And we were like, nah, what the fuck is you do? It's just got path behind us and we popped out and found this. It's pretty awesome. Now we're gonna make our way and we'll pull it back around before you're tired and then go up to Mayberg and find a taxi. Then she will get tired. Right then, only thing left to do is jump in and have a swim. We'll see later what was down there. <laughs> Try to go underneath in the rocks and that. <laughs> Water break, it's hot. Could dehydrate, it's a long way to go. It's hot and we sheltered from the wind on that side, so wow. Yo. That was brutal. To hike along there, all the way along the beach, all the way to there, and then we're gonna see if we can see like from the end of that point, if we can see the city view in the distance there. But we just finished all our water. Stupid, we didn't bring more, so it's gonna be it's gonna be a hot hike. Yeah. So in Vietnam we've got zero cell phone roaming because South Africa obviously doesn't have an agreement because well couldn't even get visas for you so we can't phone. We've got no Wi-Fi. We're just hoping a taxi comes by that's empty. Cool. So it's busy, we caught a taxi to here to back to the beach because it was a long way to walk. Decided to catch a taxi back. Now we need to go find a cold drink. Cold is the key word. Oh it's fun too. Thank you. Fun spot to get something to eat and then we're gonna go chill on the beach here. But it's nice and cold in the, in the shade. So, but now we can see anymore. I don't know, maybe they. So, yeah, we got a tour with the Roots team. We came up to Bunny Hills. Let's go see what it looks like at the top there. This is the Golden Hands Bridge. Very cool spot to discover. As you can see behind me, it's a cool hand. It's meant to be the mountain. The mountain gods. The mountain gods in their hands holding it up. So that's what we're checking out. It's easy for Wade and I to spot each other. He's the tall guy over there, and I'm the tall, I'm the tall guy over here. So that's how we find each other in the crowd. We just look for the other tall guy. There he is, there behind the guy with the flag. I can actually see him over the umbrellas. Yeah, so today's perfect weather to be up here because weather's great. You can see a lot and what an amazing view. Very epic. Oh my gosh. <laughs> So we're heading 
into the wine cellar. Wade's not keen. Oh, look at that. It's going to get dark. It's like the Pied Piper of Hamlet. They said this was built in 1923. I think it was built in 2008. Right, so we're on the tram, funicular train. We're going to go up to the next part. Huh. I thought we were going that way because that castle goes huge. It goes all the way that way. Now we're going that way. Hello. 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 <laughs> Right, so we just oh, ate a lunch in a dodgy buffet. Now we're gonna go find the roller coaster. Oh, this might be the funicular, not the roller coaster. Double high speed Alpine coaster. Oh. No. Okay, double speed is just double that speed. It's not the normal speed that we used to. So instead of going on a long, slow roller coaster where the queue was super long, we decided to just uh, chill here and have a nap for like half an hour. There's not much else to do. The place is just crazy busy and you can be on a... Can you say commercialism? We're done with the tour. We're going to head back and get some rest. On the bus even, have a nap. And... Yeah, it was cool to see you. Now we got to find out. Tour guide lady. Oh, there she is. Yellow flag. Let's go. And this brings an end to our trip here in Vietnam. We're going to be heading to the airport soon, so I'm just going to jump in the pool, have a last swim, cool off, and uh, chill out. We're just going to enjoy some rest and downtime after a busy three days at the event, working from 7 in the morning until like 11 p.m. at night. So it's a long day shooting and editing and as usual we don't normally film much uh, vlogging of that because that's pretty much busy 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 go 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 non-stop so now just yeah gonna enjoy the view chill out and have a bit of a swim and then we're gonna head to the airport